Yeah. When the office close, when the office all is second week of January, before them office just all. Where's those those people? Marissa, I'm vlogging. Huh? I'm vlogging. You? I'm vlogging. You're vlogging. Vlogging. Oh, you're vlogging. Okay, sorry. <laughs> no. <laughs> Mr. Bragging. No, I'm just I tell you. You know, so I'm gonna do YouTube, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, I don't want you to say not what you know for say. <laughs> in another video, but I'm not saying if we talk. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. The man said people over court normally. Some of them, but I remember you now when the office closed, when when um court get recessed, right? Yeah. Yeah, so. No, we leave a court matter now, go and say so some offices that are closed. So all we need to do is just set we um set our voice note, set our voicemail, and make them know so we are closed for one, two weeks. I don't know, Miss Miss uh, My yeah. boss. <laughs> Your boss. Wake up fast. Marissa with the nice music them they like the young people music. I'm sorry. Picking up in this bad. Yeah, that that can go on, but I like me that you read a while ago. Say hi. Hi! <laughs> That's my no, you know, don't know about God forbid. Buying it. So, my basically, if I go um, cross the road, I got the Western Union. You know, so them rub the Western Union at all? Mm -hmm. Eleven million dollars? Yeah. Them kind of keep it hush hush. Yeah, so I go up there last week, Monday. To pick up some money. Wait, you said town, you mean downtown? Yeah, don't them have I think them have one uh King Street, that's the main one. Mm -hmm. Them have one a uh, and Street. I don't really like that one there because it's too like it you know like a corner like mm -hmm. and you have one up a captains. But the other day I go to the main street, the main one a uh, King Street, right? Mm -hmm. I must say like it it like not yellow tape, like it's screen off police and them said close for the day. No, but never tell me say a robbery, but me, me from me see me I say a robbery. So me I say who could have hold up Western Union as it open so early? Yeah. So me say all right then whatever. Me go the following day me go to the other one and the man said them close for the week. So me I say what could have happened? Then Miss Cousins I tell me say she here and when me go read me go up on Google go look me see it on Loop News and when you read it them say them basically I keep it tightly to me Mar. That look like an inside thing because it is an inside, it's an inside thing. Because I eleven million dollar and them close up on everything. Where you tell me say the place not have alarm and them no want to give no them no want to issue no statement or anything like that. Well, they need to look inside because when you got Western Union, they want a bag of information. They want to know who was sending money why. What a relation to you? Them want the people them address, all different type of things. So are them something of them for it, but. That roof. Guys, every time I begin for vlog, somebody I pass. So today is November 22nd. I'm a little bit late, early, but a little bit late. It's like 25 past seven now, because I was up late last night making some dreads um, for one of my clients. Yes. Um, somebody asked me, morning. Somebody asked me for make some dreads for them. Yes. So, and I have like three different sets of dreads to make so yeah guys happy thanksgiving um i know my jamaicans don't celebrate it i have some friends that are living in america they are so jamaican and they are too jamaican when you're in rome you do as the rome man's do 
because when foreigners there Jamaica, they might wear them black, green and gold, so I don't see anything wrong if when you're overseas and you want to partake in, well, <laughs> you, you see me, I walk and I talk on my phone and you, you set up a steer for me, so I don't really see nothing wrong if when you're overseas and you want to partake in um, what is going on, because when the tourists them come to Jamaica, them celebrate our holidays, them wear our colors, so Jamaicans make it look like if you're in a foreign and if you, you are wear any other color separate from black, green and gold or if you are trying to celebrate them holiday, they make it look like oh you're fake or you sell out or something. Nah, do as you please. I remember the first time I traveled my goway, I'm going to post some picture for um, Thanksgiving. Somebody got said to me, say, like the mother said to me, say, I don't remember what the person um, said to me um, when I post a picture. Like, I post a picture and say, Happy Thanksgiving. I like him. They say, Oh, you come off foreign. I don't remember, but it was a slick comment. And it, I had to get back slick. It's four years ago. I can't really remember, but I had to get back um, slick. But you're in a white man country, enjoying the perks of the white man country. The least you can do is celebrate something. So, happy Thanksgiving to, you know, all the people in America, Canada. I don't know if people in the UK celebrate it as well, but at the end of the day, Thanksgiving is a holiday to be thankful. So, yeah, guys, later. Hey guys, morning. <laughs> Today is November the 23rd, the best day of November, my birthday. Actually, I got work. I was not supposed to go to work, but shit happens. I always say that I don't want to work on my birthday, and then I always end up working on my birthday. But I think I will go for half day today because I plan to leave and go and get my nails done. I still don't have any plans, but you know, I'm just like, God, thanks for life. 31. This is how 31 look. <laughs> so the boy I pass and I look for better laugh. Chuma said this is how 31 looks. Yes. What? This is how 31 looks. So yeah guys. But that's how I got a bus stop. So later. Guys, I'm at work. I look so pretty today. I look so pretty today. So so pretty today. Guys, my birthday started off wonderful. Um I see all the wishes coming in my what my makeup crease right here, so wanna see it? Cause I put the tie in I don't like putting on the tie, it crease it. But I'll fix that later. I don't know what to say. I'm just so happy. Um yeah. I don't know what to say, I'm just so happy. Um I don't know. I'm having a wonderful day. I hope nothing or no one spoils it. And I just want to thank God for another year of life. I can't believe I'm 31. I can't, I can't believe I'm 31. Like, I'm officially, officially an adult and I'm officially, officially in the 30s club. I'm over 30. <laughs> Little guys. <laughs> Hey guys, so it's the following day after my birthday. It's November the 24th and it's like about 2 something in the morning or about 2.30 and I am still up. One, because it's the weekend and I have no work tomorrow and two, I was just basically doing some light, like, I wouldn't say cleaning up but I'm just basically kind of decluttering my room. Um... I am I want to start preparing for Christmas. I want to paint. I want to go to the hardware tomorrow and get some paint. I want to start my Christmas shopping. Like whomever I'm getting gifts for, I want to start getting them one one. You know, I'm put them down or two two. I have a list of everything that I want to get for everybody. Um and normally every year what I try to do is sort out clothes that I'm no longer wearing or clothes that I hardly wear. Things that are in good condition and I try to donate them. Um, that's my good deed that I try to do every year. I go through my things and I go through my son's things because my son will wear clothes. Like 
when him de home all him wear is underpants from him in the house and him no go road like that unless him go shop or him go out or something and then especially since him at the grade that he's in now I try to keep him off the road as much as possible and when I say off the road because he don't normally go road like for go up him father on the his father to go at his father on the weekend and you know to maybe play with his cousins or something like that I try to like cut it down so him really don't go anywhere so when him in the house all him wears underpants and whatever so like a lot of the stuff he's no longer wearing and he's growing fast like him, him just I get big overnight so he might wear something this week and by next week or next month it no longer fit him like or it fit him um last month or just not fitting him any at all so I went through his stuff as well there, there's like a whole pile behind me and one on the floor so yeah and then I have to get up tomorrow morning because I need to go to the um the salon to get my nails done because look at my nails for my birthday I've been wearing these nails for like a month and my nail tech is good because none of these um nails are lifting so I'm not even gonna take them off I'm going to do a refill I know she's miserable and whatever I might you know skin up her face but I'm gonna do a refill because this morning when it was I woke up and my, my son said to me mommy your nails not done for your birthday so I said I was gonna do them tomorrow I said you should have gotten them done yesterday because your birthday is today you see, you see the level of maturity him just enough and of course it made me feel extra special because he was showering me with all sorts of compliments and he might kiss me up and he might hug me up and he might tell me mommy you're really 31 mommy you're really 31 for true you know look 31 I said oh 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 is 31 supposed to look 31 supposed to look old I think not um yeah same same look young i'm look good xyz whatever yeah but i had a really wonderful day i went nowhere for my birthday i i was truly overwhelmed today and like up in the week i said that i was not gonna post on my birthday to like announce it was my birthday and i didn't announce it was my birthday like to say one day to my birthday tomorrow is the big day um keep calm today is my birthday keep calm tomorrow is my birthday i didn't do any of that but when i saw how many people were wishing my birthday i don't know if they went on um i don't know if they got a notification from facebook i don't know if something came up in their memory i don't know if they went on my instagram page and went to the bottom to see exactly when i celebrated my birthday for last year because let's come on we all do them kind of stuff they like i know everybody's birthday everybody everybody birthday my friend my best friend born the third of march my other friend born the 31st of uh, march um my other friend born the 1st of October, one born the 2nd of November, um, one born the 11th of September, one born the 3rd of September, my sister the 25th, my mother the 16th, my sister, other sister the 26th, my brother the 9th. I know everybody's birthday. Everybody. Birthday. My boy, the 5th of February, my other friend, um, the 5th of February, she and my boyfriend celebrated one birthday coming up the first of december like listen i am good with dates so like certain people i don't have to search or anything one band the 16th of august like i don't have to search when you come on to some people um but you know like your little internet friends they might mm, you know but it was good I, I i i took my own advice as well not to expect and i didn't expect anything and let me tell you the day was good i went to work um tomorrow i might go to a movie and i'm thinking of going to the river on sunday so i don't want but i'm just not foreseeing up myself or anything because really for my birthday and my life when i woke up the first thing i did was pray uh thank god for another day thank him that i'm healthy you know i just thank god overall i just I, you know all praises to god i just really thanked him 
and I was truly happy. I'd, I felt down not one time for today, not one time at all, not once. You know, it was a lovely day. Went to work, worked the entire day, came home, did nothing, and I'm at peace. I'm good. So, yeah, I was overwhelmed though. Like, the wishes were coming in, coming in, coming in, coming. Like, to tell everybody thank you. I just wanted, I just had to do like a video to put everybody in. I mean, once I did that video, like, the other persons like that didn't know started to come in with the happy birthdays and you know accepted it as well you know so yeah yeah guys so i'm going to edit this vlog and upload it and when i go on the road tomorrow i will vlog i will take you guys along with me so bye guys and thank you all again for the wishes thank you for my gifts um yeah, I got some stuff. I got some stuff. Like, my friends really love me, you know. My family love me, too. And when I say family, like, I know that my family love me, but for me, I count family as, um, like, my immediate family. Um, child, mother, brother, sister. Like, others are relatives. So, my aunt, I say family. That's who I'm talking about. They love me. And my friends like I have some friends that they really love me you know some express in words some give gift but yeah they love me so yeah guys thank you and I just the only thing I wish for is that I can't see another birthday that's all you know 2019 I'm ready for 2019 like last year um for me I never like to rush out a year like people would say oh come or you can come um 2019 title 2018 2018 I mean I'm in 2018 no I'm seeing what 2018 has to offer I don't know what 2019 is coming with I don't know if it's coming with good I don't know if it's coming with bad but at the end of the day anything at all it comes with it's life you understand life is a mixture of both it's a balance just like your ph you have bad and you have good and you just have to sort it out they say as long as you fall on your back they say it's not that you fall but from your fall on your back for you can look up you can always get up so it's not about falling it's about getting up you know it's about getting up so I don't like to rush out a year and say XYZ whatever because let me tell you something 2018 started off rough for me I know it's not compared to some people's rough but 2018 started out rough for me 2018 taught me a lot of things it you know really opened my eyes it really shook me up so yeah I'm ready for 2019 um, I'm still enjoying 2018. I wanted to take it time as much as possible because I still really can't believe that 2018 is almost over. Like, I remember lying in bed beside my boyfriend when 2018 came in. So, scary. So, yeah, guys. Bye. I talked too much. I totally talked too much in this video. Bye, guys.